How probable is it that this tiny people, the Jewish people, numbering less than one-fifth of one percent of the population of the world, should have outlived, as you just heard, the world's greatest empires, the Egyptians, the Assyrians, the Babylonians, the Greeks, the Romans, every empire that ever stood up to destroy us. They have been consigned to history, and still we stand and sing Am Yisrael Chai. How likely is it that after 2,000 years of exile, our people should have come back to our land and there, in having stood eyeball to eyeball in Auschwitz a mere three years earlier, eyeball to eyeball with the angel of death in 1948, said, despite the worst crime of man against man, I will not die, but I will live. Israel is the greatest collective affirmation of life in the whole of Jewish history. Friends. Israel has taken a barren land and made it bloom again. Israel has taken an ancient language, the language of the Bible, and make it speak again. Israel has taken the West's oldest faith and made it young again. Israel has taken a shattered nation and make it live again. Friends, let us not rest until Israel's light shines throughout the world, the world's great symbol of life and hope. Amen.